ఆయన దాన్ని మీరు చెప్పండి గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ స్టూడెంట్స్ గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ యూ ఆల్ ఆర్ సేఫ్ ఎలా ఉన్నారు అంత బాగున్నారా ఓకే సో వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు అవర్ ఆన్లైన్ క్లాసెస్ ఇన్ ది ప్రీవియస్ క్లాస్ వీ హ్యావ్ డిస్కసింగ్ అబౌట్ ది సర్కిల్స్ అండ్ బేసిక్ కాన్సెప్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ ది సర్కిల్స్ ఓకే సో ఇన్ ది సిరీస్ ఆఫ్ ది అవర్ లెసన్స్ సో వీ హ్యావ్ డిస్కసింగ్ నౌ tangent equation of a tangent okay so in the earlier class the previous class we had discussed about the tangent what is tangent called tangent power of a point etc okay so i remember this concept once again so equation of a tangent tangent what is a tangent first of all we recall this tangent is a line which touches the circle at one and only one point at one and only one point the line which touches the circle at one and only one point is called the tangent so in this figure you are seeing this figure the circle the origin center of the circle is origin and the line tangent the line touches the circle at the point p x1 comma y1 so okay we say that point p x1 comma y1 right so now we have to find the equation of the tangent the equation of the tangent what is the equation of this tangent okay so we can find the tangent equation of tangent or we can express the equation of tangent in three ways okay one point form point form okay second one is slope form and the third one is parametric form parametric form okay okay so we can express the or we can find the or we can derive the tangent the equation of tangent in three ways that is point form slope form parametric form okay so first of all we start with point form okay it means we know a point on the tangent we know a point on the tangent if we know the point on the tangent when it touches the circle we can find the the equation of the tangent by using that point okay that is point form okay right so first we discuss about point form okay so we consider that the equation of the circle let s is equal to x square plus y square is equal to r square the equation of the circle which have in the center zero zero and radius r free a circle with the center zero comma zero Okay, C zero comma zero center C zero comma zero and radius R and radius is equal to R. Okay, so this is the particular set of the circle. Okay, let P x one comma y one is P x one comma y one is a point on the circle. On the circle, point on the circle. Okay. So P x one comma y one is a point on the circle. That means it is a contact point. Point of contact. Okay. Point of contact. Right. so here cp distance between c and p is r radius of the circle okay so what is the distance what is the slope of the line cp what is the slope of the line cp then we can find the slope of the tangent okay next we can find the equation of the tangent by using the slope of the tangent at the point okay 
Right. So this is the so tangent is perpendicular to the radius. Why? Because the radius is passing through the center of the circle and it is perpendicular to the tangent. Okay. So therefore, so you guys let slope of slope of <coughs> radius or normal slope of radius that is normal that is perpendicular line to the tangent normal slope of normal cp slope of normal yes sir suppose slope of slope of normal is equal what is the formula y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 so y2 minus y1 means y2 means in place of y2 y1 minus 0 by x1 minus 0 ok so that is y1 by x1 so slope of normal slope of normal is equal y1 by x1 so what is the slope of the tangent what is the slope of the tangent the both lines are perpendicular. So, product of perpendicular lines, product of slopes of perpendicular lines is equal to minus 1. Product of perpendicular lines of slopes is minus 1. So, therefore, so slope of tangent, slope of tangent is equal to, suppose, ST. Therefore, Sn into Ft is equal to minus 1. Slope of normal into slope of tangent is equal to minus 1 because Cp is perpendicular to suppose Pt tangent. Okay, since let Therefore, Sn is equal to y1 by x1 into slope of tangent is equal to minus 1. Therefore, slope of tangent is equal to minus 1 into x1 by y1. So, this is equal to minus x1 by y1. So, this is slope of tangent. Okay. Slope of tangent is equal to minus x1 by y1. So, we know the slope of the tangent. We know the slope of the tangent. And we know the point on the tangent. Okay? So equation of tangent, therefore, equation of tangent. Which passes through which passes through x1 comma y1 and slope. Minus x1 by y1. Okay. First look, minus x1 by y1. So what is the equation? Equation of a line. So formula y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. So y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. This is the formula to find the equation of a line. So therefore y minus y1 is equal to m. M is slope here. Minus x1 by y1 into x minus <coughs> okay minus x minus x so this for y into so y1 into y minus <coughs> is equal to minus x1 into x minus x1 so for y y1 minus y1 square is equal to minus x x1 minus into minus plus x1 square Okay. So minus x x1 is this one, suppose carry forward is minus x x1 <coughs> y y1 therefore x x1 plus y y1 is equal to x1 square plus y1 square okay. plus y1 square. So x1 square plus y1 square is equal to r square because x square plus y square is equal to r square and p x1 y1 is a point on the circle. So therefore, 
x one square plus y one square is equal to r square. Therefore, this is equal to r square. So, the equation of tangent is x x one plus y y one is equal to r square. So, that is the equation of tangent. Okay, the equation of tangent. <coughs> x x one plus y y one is equal to so this is the equation of the tangent. Okay, right? So this is the equation of the tangent. Okay, this is point of form. Right? Case two. Suppose here is a center of the circle is zero zero. We can say zero zero or zero. Suppose we can say the circle minus zero comma minus of center. Okay. So case two. Yes. So let us consider this is called x square plus y square plus two x plus two y plus c for zero. Be a circle. Get the center. C for minus c comma minus f. And Radius is equal to r. Okay, so radius r. Okay, so let and p x one comma y one be a point on the circle. So what is the uh, equation? Of what is the slope of the? Therefore, slope of normal. Slope of normal. Yes, sir. Is equal to y1 plus f by x1 plus z. Y1 plus f by x1 plus z. Okay. So since S R into S T is equal to minus one, therefore S T is equal to okay. Slope of tangent is equal to suppose S T. Therefore S R into S T is equal to minus one. Therefore, so S R S R is equal to y one plus r by x one plus z. Okay. Therefore, S T is equal to minus one into the x one plus z by y one plus y. Okay. So this is equal to minus half the x one plus z by y one plus y. Okay. So this is the slope of the tangent. Slope of the tangent. What is the equation of tangent? Which passes through x one y one slope is next minus x one plus z by y one plus y. Okay, so this is the slope minus x one plus z by y one plus y. So equation is same like okay. So the formula y minus y one is equal to x minus x one. So y minus y one. Into m, m is minus x1 plus g by y1 plus y into x minus x1. Okay. So carry forward this y minus y1 into y1 plus y is equal to minus of x1 plus g into x minus x1. Okay. 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 By simplifying this equation, we can get the final equation of the tangent. Okay, right? We can get this. Right? So y y one y y one y. 
plus y d f plus y f minus y1 into y1 minus y1 square <coughs> minus y1 into f minus y1 f is equal minus x into x minus x1 x x1 minus x x1 minus x1 into minus x1 plus x1 square <coughs> plus x1 square minus g into x minus g x minus g x minus x1 minus g x1 into minus plus g x1 okay plus g x1 Plus GX, right? Okay. X X1 plus YY1 plus GX plus YF minus Y1F is equal to X1 squared plus Y1 squared plus GX1, okay? So by adding GX1 and F by 1 on both sides by adding GX1 plus G yeah, F by 1 on both sides both sides GX1 plus Y by 1 ok therefore XX1 plus Y by 1 plus by adding GX1 GX plus GX1 therefore G into X plus X1 plus we are in F by 1, so F by 1, F by 1, okay, so F by 1, that is 2F by 1, F by 1 plus F by 1, that is F into Y plus Y by 1, okay, so F into Y plus Y by 1, minus, okay, X1 square plus Y1 square plus, X, GX1 plus GX1 2G GX1 okay F by 1 plus F by 1 that is no. 2 F by 1 2F by 1 so this is the XX1 plus Y1 2X plus X1 plus Y1 plus Y1 plus Y1 plus Y1 plus Y1 2F by 1 okay so this is equal to minus C why? Because by 
S11. So S11 is equal to X1 square plus Y1 square plus 2 X1 plus 3 F1 plus C is equal to 0. Okay. By S11. Since x1 square plus y1 square plus 2x1 plus 2x1 plus 0. Okay? Therefore, x1 square plus y1 square plus 2x1 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 plus f into y plus y1 plus c is equal to 0. So this is the equation of the triangle. Okay. So this is the equation of the triangle. Okay. So equation of the triangle. So this is called S1. S1 is equal to 0. C is equal to 0, this is equal to S1 is equal to 0. So this is the equation of the tangent. So we can find the equation of the tangent in point form in two ways. That is, if we take, we consider the circle which is center is origin 0, 0, then xx1 plus y1 is equal to r square, that is the equation of tangent. If we consider the equation of the circle, that is the center of the circle minus the then we can we have the equation of the tangent x x one plus y y one plus g x plus x one plus f into y plus y one plus c is equal to g. It is so in standard form in standard expression we consider this s one. Okay, the equation is s one s one is equal to g. Right. So these are the equation of tangent in point form. These two. Okay. So remember these two. We have to we will discuss the uh, second. A that is, uh, what is this? Slope form. Okay? Slope form. Okay, we will discuss this slope form in next class. Okay? Next class we will discuss this slope form. It is not tangent. Okay, students. So, go through the, uh, go through the subject, go through the class. Okay? So, observe the class well. Watch the video well. Okay? And you have to prepare. Try to so derive the equation of tangents okay in this way at our core okay if you have any doubt you will call me you will call on my phone okay okay bye okay